When it comes to forging talent that defines generations, Pittsburgh has proved to be an enduring machine, and few teams in history have asserted as great a presence in the Pro Football Hall of Fame as the Steelers. <laughs> Including this year's class, the Hall of Fame now lists 24 of its members as major contributors to the Steelers, which puts Pittsburgh in the top three in NFL history. Although some Steelers from the franchise's early history are enshrined in Canton, Pittsburgh's Hall of Fame ascension was more recent and dramatic than most of its NFL counterparts, making its presence even more remarkable. If you're not at the stadium at one o'clock on Sunday in the fall, you're in the wrong place. Since the 1987 induction of Joe Green, an incredible 19 Steelers have been voted into the Hall of Fame as major contributors, the most of any team in that time. While the NFL was founded in 1920, Art Rooney didn't establish the Pittsburgh Steelers until 1933. And for the first four decades, Pittsburgh went without a playoff win. By the late 1960s, the Chief had turned over control of the team to his oldest son, Dan, who charted the course that sent the Steelers on a journey of sustained success. That began in 1969 with the hiring of Chuck Knoll, who would retire in 1992 as the winningest coach in franchise history and one of the best in NFL history before being inducted into the Hall of Fame in 1993. Knoll transformed Pittsburgh's roster by drafting nine Hall of Famers through his first six years, starting with his first ever pick, Green, the cornerstone of the dynasty. Steelers first round selection, Joe Green, G-R-E-E-N-E. -E. Throughout the 70s, Knoll assembled the greatest team in football history, winning four Super Bowls in six years. The Steelers fielded 10 Hall of Fame players on one roster, balanced perfectly with five on each side of the ball. The Pittsburgh Steelers are the champions of the National Football League for the fourth time. The 1970s established a Hall of Fame standard in Pittsburgh, and Dan Rooney made sure it would endure by leading the franchise into the salary cap free agency era with a vision that bridged the Steelers' first four Super Bowl championships with their next two. And all of that has allowed their presence on Hall of Fame weekend to continue across decades. With the appointment of head coach Bill Cowher in 1992, the Steelers committed themselves to a culture of sustained excellence. You play smart, you stay focused, you play physical. Across 15 years, Coach Cower led the Steelers to the best overall record in the NFL. In an era engineered to prevent supremacy, he was a steward of greatness who continued to develop Hall of Fame talent and fostered Pittsburgh's Hall of Fame pedigree into the new century. Later this year, the Pro Football Hall of Fame will enshrine three more Steelers. Cower, safety Donnie Shell, and safety Troy Polamalu were each voted to receive professional football's highest and most enduring individual honor. They join a Steelers brotherhood of unrelenting excellence, a fraternity of men who carved Pittsburgh's legacy of dominance into football's history, and who together forged a standard that continues to produce Hall of Famers today.